As climate change increasingly brings dangerous temperature extremes and storms and floods, the world is looking for hope, for ambition, and for action. And all of these can be found in the Montreal Protocol on substances that deplete the, the ozone layer. This agreement has put the ozone layer on the path to full recovery, and it has also brought a significant impact for the climate. Action under the protocol phased out gases used in the cooling industry, gases that destroyed the ozone layer and warmed our planet. It also stopped harmful UV radiation from devastating nature's carbon sinks and so helped to slow the rate of global warming. The protocol epitomizes the multilateralism and unity of purpose that we need to combat global environmental challenges. And the work is not yet done. Under the Kigali Amendment to the protocol, countries have begun reducing powerful climate warming gases known as hydrofluorocarbons or HFCs. Phasing down HFCs could avoid up to 0.5 degrees of warming by 2100. And using the transition to climate-friendly gases to increase the energy efficiency of cooling equipment could also double those gains. But to deliver these gains, we need every nation to ratify and fully implement the Kigali Amendment. And we need businesses to innovate on climate-friendly cooling products that hit markets fast. On this World Ozone Day, we celebrate what the Montreal Protocol has already achieved, and we look forward to more benefits for the planet and for the climate through the Kigali Amendment. With this powerful climate action tool, we can keep our homes, our food, our vaccines, and our planet cool.